Express News Service Chennai, the writing on the wall has been clear for a while. A day after informing IPL franchises that the event will not take place this summer, BCCI on Thursday announced that it has been suspended till further notice. That the board is not considering IPL as cancelled implies that it is exploring other options later this year, provided the situation improves. As things stand, BCCI has not set any window for when it will hold the tournament. BCCI is understood to have told franchises that it is optimistic about hosting the event between July to November. But sans guarantees. The health and safety of the nation and everyone involved in our great sport remains top priority. BCCI, franchise owners, broadcaster, sponsors and all stakeholders acknowledge that IPL 2020 will only commence when it is safe and appropriate to do so, a release said. Hours before IPL suspension, Sri Lanka cricket president Shami Silva told reporters in Colombo that it is open to hosting the tournament as the island nation is better placed in terms of the outbreak, if a global situation improves in the next couple of months and a window opens up in July to August, BCCI could be tempted by this offer. The two months are best suited for cricket in the region as most parts of India will see southwest monsoons. As previously reported by This Daily, top officials in BCCI believe that hosting IPL in India between September to November is the most viable option. Although parts of India receives heavy rainfall from September to October, they reckon this window will ensure the best overseas player availability. The same cannot be said for the July to August time frame as BCCI expects it will take a few more months for worldwide normalcy. Even if the situation is under control in India, we can't say for certain when borders will open for foreigners, an official in the know-how said. English and Australian players might not make it even if IPL begins in September. We also have our international calendar in those months. A lot of factors are involved which is why the tournament has been suspended, not cancelled. In case the T20 World Cup doesn't go ahead, scheduled in October to November, then BCCI might utilize the window, but that would imply a compromise with the domestic calendar, which usually begins late September. With the shortest format being in focus, BCCI could be forced to cancel one day as VJ Hazari Trophy or rejig the entire season with a new format entailing fewer matches. Few things have to be compromised under the circumstances, so we have to see what is possible and what is not the official added. What's in store? Option a July to August accept Sri Lanka cricket's offer and shift IPL there, not very viable as situation might not improve considerably by then. Option B September to November the window BCCI is targeting, if World T20 is called off in Australia. If this goes ahead, the board may have to rejig the domestic calendar or even cancel the one-day leg. VJ Hazari, Option C no IPL in 2020 the nuclear option. If the COVID-19 threat doesn't recede, this is the most likely scenario. Let's block ads. Why?